The Lusu Mines, one of the richest veins in Ivalice. Under Imperial Guard, no doubt. Actually, no. With but few exceptions, the Imperial Army is not permitted within Bujerba. Well, shall we proceed? Forgive me for asking, but you are diverting the purest of the Magicite. I can assure you it reaches Lord Vane most discreetly. Ha! <laughs> you wear your saddle well. Be that as it may, I have no intention of being bridled, Your Honor. Then you prefer the whip? Stubbornness will see not only you broken, Excellency, but Bujerba as well. Ondor IV, the Marquis of Bujerba. The Marquis served as mediator at the negotiations of Damascus' surrender. It would appear that he is somewhat less neutral now. They say he's been helping the resistance. They say many things. You're certainly well informed. Who did you say you were again? What difference does it make? We have to find Pinello. And Pinello is your... She's a friend. She was kidnapped and taken here. Hmm. <laughs> 
This is what I came here to see. What's that? It's nethocyte. Manufactured nethocyte. Nethocyte? Unlike regular magicite, nethocyte absorbs magical energy. This is the fruit of research into the manufacture of nethocyte. All at the hands of the Draclaw Laboratory. So this is where they're getting the magicite. Errand all attended to, then. Thank you. I'll repay you shortly. No, you'll repay us now. We have too much on our hands to go on holding yours. So, where did you hear this fairy tale about nethocyte? And where did you get that sample you carry? What do you know about the Draclaw Laboratories? Tell me, who are you? Balthier. You kept us waiting, Balthier! You slipped away in Nalbana! We missed you! First to judge and know this boy! The whole affair has a smell of money about it! I may have to wet my beak a little! Keep your snout in the trough where it belongs. This thinking ill befits you, Bagamnon. Balthier! <laughs> Too long have I gone unpaid! I'll carve my bounty out of that boy! Where's Pinello? We're taking her back! The girl? Why keep the bait when you've landed the fish? We cut her loose on the way here and then off she ran crying like a babe! Hey! After them! Hey, wait up! We'll not be able to take them all. Fight who we must, leave the rest. It would not seem they follow. We've lost them. Much more running about with Bunga at my heels, and I'm apt to give up sky pirating altogether.
I see you've been out walking without the company of your cortege, Lord Lhasa. We caught her wandering out of the mines. You must take care with such undesirables about. I was kidnapped! Silence! If it is a crime to wander on one's own, then I too am guilty. Marquis. I trust that your estate can accommodate another guest. Why not? Judge Geese, I shall heed your counsel. I will not travel unaccompanied any longer. 
That was unexpected. Thank you, Penelo. Uh, of course. What's Penelo doing? And what's the deal with that Lamont? That's no Lamont. Larsa Ferina Solidor, fourth son to Emperor Grammys and brother to Vane. What? That kid? Do not worry. I believe he will treat her well. Nobody knows men like Fran does. Our purposes lead the same way, to Ondor. We must find means to approach him. The Marquis is channeling money to organizations opposing the Empire. We'll start there. Marquis Andor announced my execution two years ago. If news of my survival were to spread, the Marquis may find his position compromised. The men he's been funding bear little love for the Empire. They won't be thrilled to discover that rumors of your death were, in fact, greatly exaggerated. If we were to raise a clamor to that effect, we might just get their attention. Nothing to it. I'll just go around town spreading the word. How about this? I'm Captain Bosch von Rotzenberg of Dalmaska. Well, what do you think? That certainly qualifies as a clamor. All right, Vaughn, get to it. For the girl's sake, eh? Oh, and the more people around to witness your little performance, the better. If we're going to reach the Marquis, it's up to you. We'll be waiting here if you need us. lives! I'm THE Bosch von Ronsenberg! I'm Captain Bosch von Ronsenberg of Dalmaska! Bosch lives! I'm THE Bosch von Ronsenberg! Don't listen to Ondor's lies! Don't listen to Ondor's lies! I'm THE Bosch von Ronsenberg! I'm THE Bosch von Ronsenberg! I'm Captain Bosch von Ronsenberg of Dalmaska!
don't listen to Ondor's lies. I'm Captain Bosch. I'm Captain Bosch. I'm the Bosch von Ronsenberg. lives Bosch lives! I'm the Bosch von Ronsenberg! Listen to Ondor's lies. I'm Captain Bosch. lives
Bosch lives! Bosch lives! Bosch lives! Don't listen to Ondor's lies! I'm Captain Bosch! Don't listen to Ondor's lies! I'm Captain Bosch! Bosch lives! I'm Captain Bosch! I'm Captain Bosch von Ronsenberg of Dalmaska! Bosch lives! Bosch lives! Don't listen to Ondor's lies! I'm THE Bosch von Ronsenberg! Don't listen to Ondor's lies! I'm THE Bosch von Ronsenberg! Bosch lives! I'm Captain Bosch von Ronsenberg of Dalmaska! I'm Captain Bosch von Ronsenberg of Dalmaska! Don't listen to Ondor's lies! Bosch lives!
I'm Captain Bosch von Rotzenberg of Dalmaska. I'm Captain Bosch. I'm Captain Bosch. Bosch lives. I'm Captain Bosch. I'm Captain Bosch. I'm Captain Bosch. I'm the Bosch von Ronsenberg. I'm the Bosch von Ronsenberg. This is the one, Havaro. Says he's Captain Bosch, he does. <laughs> he would sooner pass for the king. I knew he were no captain. That was a mean trick to be playing. If a trickery it ended, it would end well enough. But why this boy? And why Captain Ronsenberg? An explanation is due, and I will hear it. The Empire's hounds grow passing bold indeed. A shame if they learnt the Marquis trafficked with the likes of you. Agents masquerading as guides, a hideout at the back of a tavern? Not exactly earning high marks for originality, are we? Now you've done Wait. it! So Bash von Ronsenberg does yet live. So Vaughn really is all right. I didn't think I'd ever get to see him again. You will join him soon. And until then, I shall see that you are kept from harm. Thank you. I am troubled. The Rabanasta Imperial Guard appear to have overstepped their bounds. I intend to speak on this with the Consul. What? Vain Solidor, the Consul, is my brother. <gasps> the first duty of the Consul is to maintain order in Dalmasca. My brother... my brother is not one given to failure. Perhaps things aren't going as well as they might be, but give him a little time and he will put things to rights. Be not troubled. My brother is a remarkable man. He frightens me. Why? I'm sorry. He is your brother. It's just, you don't understand how much we lost to the war. My friends, my parents. So you fear the Empire? Listen to me. The men of my family, we are taught to place the needs of others before those of our own. I will see that you are kept from harm. It is my duty to House Solidor. But how? How can I trust you? Because I give you my word. My brother would do no less. I knew there must be more to it, but to find you at the end of this tale? <laughs> ah, to see the Marquis's face when he learns of it. I should like nothing more. I would meet him and see for myself. How say you, my lord? There is little to be said. 
I shall arrange a meeting with the Marquis. We shall expect you at the estate. Sir Bosch von Ronsenberg, it was not so very long ago that I announced you had been executed. And that is the only reason I draw breath. So you are the sword he strung above my head. Vain has left not a thing to chance. And? A leader of the resistance has fallen into Imperial hands. A woman by the name of Amalia. I would rescue her, but I need your help. This resistance leader, this Amalia, she must be very important. You understand I have my position to consider. Would you let us see Larsa? He's got my friend with him. I'm afraid you're too late. Lord Larsa's cortege has already rejoined the Imperial Detachment. I am told they will depart for Rabanaster upon the arrival of the fleet this eventide. Ah. to calm down. Captain Ronsenberg, surely the exigencies of position are not lost on you. Why, indeed, you should find the enemy's chains an easy burden to bear. Wait. Sorry, can't be helped. Summon the guard. Huh? They are to be taken to Judge Geese. Those decrepit basking fools in Arcades tie my hands and look what happens. I tell you, this country's obstinacy knows no bounds. The insurgents in Ravanasta operate alone at present. However, should they garner external support, the situation could worsen. We have found the counter-imperial elements in Bujerba to be conspicuously well-funded. No doubt Marquis Ondor is behind this. Ondor must be reined in. By the way, the Marquis has written us a letter. He claims that he's recaptured our runaway. He's given him to Geese. He will die by my hand. Your fraternity is moving. Ah, Geese returns with Larsa. Tomorrow morning they will leave Bujerba. See him home safely, Gabranth.
Now I'm expecting Dr. Sid. You may leave. We must see the real thing, to be sure. Nabadis taught us much. Yes, it's well hidden. They'll be off chasing after shadows, the fools. Ah, yes. The reins of history back in the hands of man. Ah, Vane. You seem to be enjoying your job as consul. I was kept waiting fully two years. What news of Arcades, our honored members of the Senate? Hard at work, as always, trying to find a dagger for your back. Mm. <laughs> they are welcome to try. The prisoners, my lord! <sighs> Majesty! After what you've done, how dare you! You're supposed to be dead. Come now, come now! Have you forgotten your manners? This is hardly the courtesy due the late Princess Ashelia Benagin Dalmasca. Princess? To be sure, she bears no proof of her former station, no different than any mean member of the insurgents. The Resistance. His Excellency the Consul asks the Ministry of the Dethroned Royal Family in restoring peace to Dalmasca. Those who foster instability and unrest who claim royal blood without proof, they shall meet their fate at the gallows. There are no exceptions. I will not play puppet to Vane. King Ramanas entrusted me with a task. Should the time come, he bade me give you something of great importance. It is your birthright, the Dusk Shard. It will warrant the quality of her blood. Only I know where to find it. Wait! You took my father's life. Why spare mine now? You would have me live in shame! If that is your duty, yes. Stop being so stubborn. Keep on like this and you're gonna get us all killed. Don't interrupt. What? Vaughn, that stone. It, it was in the palace treasure. Well, well. Ha ha ha! Splendid! You brought the stone with you. This spares us a great deal of trouble. Don't give it to him! Uh. Uh. You have to promise. No executions. A judge's duty is to the law. Take them away. My lord! Lady Ash is to be quartered separately. <sighs> Vain Solidor, what fascination does this hold for you? So you were carrying it all along? The fate's jest. <sighs> Tell these fates of yours to leave me out. Keep quiet! There was nothing else that I could do. You know that. Oh, I understand. Honor, duty, and all that. I still can't believe that was Watch a free Keep quiet! <laughs> <laughs> Thank <sighs> you.
The Marquis has been busy. Not lightly did I beg his aid. Listen, it's been a full two years. I alone have kept Her Majesty safely hidden. I doubted friend and foe alike. I could trust nobody. You did your duty, and mine for me. I'm getting her out. I need your help. Of course.